Hi guys, today we are gonna review this condenser microphone by Vig, which is the VM50. And this one right now costs about $50 on Amazon with the coupon. If you think this is something in your budget range, feel free to check it out on Amazon. I have the link in the description below. And now let's get into it. On the box, it says cardioid pattern, plug and play, and also clear sound. Let's find out if that's true. So we have a menu here. It seems like we got a few languages here and it's gonna be pretty easy to understand them if you know it. And each language has only four pages, which is very easy to understand and super simple to set up. And next we have our cable and the cable seems pretty nice because we have uh, USB type C and also a USB, which is pretty nice because for Mac user, you don't have to buy an adapter anymore. So you can just use it right away. And the length of the cable is about 80 inches, which is pretty long for any devices that you're gonna use this on. And then next will be our microphone. Let's get it out. So right off the box, I feel the quality, man. This thing doesn't feel like a $50 microphone. It feels like around a hundred bucks. It's really well made. It's light, but the quality is really solid. The stand is made by metal along with the microphone itself is metal too. I feel like almost 90% of this thing is made by metal, but it's pretty light. Under the stand, we have three rubber feet. So it's not gonna be slippery on your desk. And also the angle of the microphone can be adjusted by loose this knob right here. And then we can set an angle that meets our need. And once it does, and just lock it, and it should be in place. And this kit does come with a shockwave mount. So when you shake your desk, the movement on your desk, it won't affect your voice. And also in the front, we have a pop filter. And this thing will prevent us to have the pop sound. And on the microphone, there's only one key, which is really simple to operate. So just the gain less or gain more. And when you press it, it will mute the microphone. And when you press again, it will unmute. And also this logo is the LED, which we're gonna see next. Under the microphone, we have our USB Type-C port and also our audio port. So this is the non-latency port, which you can plug in your headset or headphone and to listen to your own voice. And I do see some screws on the mount. That means we can take the microphone out. So if you want to hold your microphone to speak, you could, but I don't think we can mount it because I don't see any mount holes for it. So it's gonna be a desk microphone. Like he says in the menu, to set up is really simple. All we need to do is just plug in the USB to our PC, or you can plug in by the USB type C. And then we just need to plug in the other end to the microphone. And once we do that, your PC will automatically detect the microphone and also the LED will light up. And for a microphone to have a LED light, which is really nice. Not only that, this LED will indicate the microphone either on mute or on unmute. By pressing this button, it will turn red, that means it's on mute. And press again, it's on mute. So right now I'm using this VM50 and with 50% value on the OBS and with all my filters off. So this is the exactly sound from this microphone. And the distance between me and the microphone is about 12 inches now. And this is how it sounds like when I get really close to it. And right now I'm at 100% uh, value. And as you guys can see, it's getting picked red. So the gain on this microphone is really good. And now I'm gonna read a little story and I'll change the value from low to high, from close to far, so you have a better idea of this microphone. Once upon a time, a mouse gave birth to a baby mouse and the snake gave birth to a serpent. The mouse prohibited her baby from playing at a broker near her house. Let's they drown and die. One day, the baby mouse and the serpent met and become friends and play together. And, and right now, I'm gonna just leave it on and with my AC on so you can hear all the noises. So I'll turn it to the max. And I just noticed that we can actually remove this filter, the pop filter. There's two buttons, uh, so let me remove it. All right. And now this is how it sounds without the pop filter. I don't think it's gonna make that much difference with the pop filter on or off when you far away from the microphone. And also if you don't scream too much, uh, 
you you won't make that pop noise. But when when we speak too closely to the microphone, and sometimes it will make the pop noise. So it's better to have this guy on. So which is really nice by this company. So let's put it back. And now let's test it if it's cardioid. Alright, so seems like it does that cardio a trick. And now let me put back all my filters on. And now let me read that story again. Once upon a time, a mouse gave birth to a baby mouse. And the snake gave a birth to a serpent. The mouse prohibited her baby from playing at the brook near her house. Lest the drown and die. One day, the baby mouse and the serpent met and became friends and played together. Now it's much better, right? So overall guys, if your budget is around 50 bucks and want a very decent microphone that sounds really pro and has a lot of features such as the pop filter and the USB Type-C and also some cool LED lights, you may consider to get one of these. And if you ask me what I don't like about this microphone, one thing will be the cable because it's not 90 degree and when we put the microphone all the way down for the angle, uh, the cable is kind of bent. Uh, I don't like that. And also I wish there's a mount hole so we can mount this microphone on a mount instead of always leave it on the table because it's very hard for cable management. Other than those two, I absolutely like this microphone. All right, now let's see who is the lucky guy for the video league giveaway. Ding, 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 ding. Congratulations, Bebamhoo, Prasley Sahoo.